Hello and welcome back, this is NHSDL 06, and this is my Let's Play Part 2 of Link's Awakening. Alright, last time where we left off, we were told by our friend, the Owl, that we were supposed to head north into the mysterious forest and to get the key to unlock the tail cave, so we're going to do just that. Alright, these blue guys here, the Moblins, pretty common enemies in the Zelda universe. Alright, not too tough yet. Come back here. Alright. Alright. Now here. Here's this interesting little fellow. Our friend, the raccoon. As a raccoon, my nose is very sensitive to stuff like dust and powder. Alright. So this guy. Sensitive dust and powder doesn't make any sense. I don't know what that can mean. <laughs> You're going to be lost thanks to me. <laughs> well, actually, no, we're not because I know what I know to do. But, you know. The first time I played this, I got lost and had quite a tough time figuring out what to do. And this was before game manuals were really popular. Alright. Uh, these little black bat creatures are called keys. Pretty easy to. Oh, okay, I'm stupid. Wow, that was dumb. <laughs> anyway, you'll see, uh. Some of the panels that are on the ground here are, uh, look like they have cracks in them. If you stand on those too long, you will fall through a pit, much like the black ones you already see. Alright, let's open up this chest and see what we got. You got 50 rupees, very nice. Awesome, 50 rupees, that's sweet. Moving on. Alright. These little green blob things are, uh, okay, gels. Anyway, oh, this is interesting. You've got a guardian acorn. It will reduce the damage you take by half. Alright, so in this forest, there are two different types of items that you can get. There's the guardian acorn that we just got, and there's also the uh, piece of power, which is a glowing triangle. So the acorn will uh, boost your defense and reduce all damage by half for a short period of time. Obviously, once the song is done, you, it's obviously over. But, uh, and the piece of power increases your power. It's pretty you know, self-explanatory. You pick the toadstool. As you hold it over your head, a mellow aroma flows into your nostrils. Hmm, that's weird. I wonder what that could be. Ah, that's right. Take that, jerk. Okay, there's nothing else here, so... There's gotta be something we can do with that mushroom. Hmm, Alright, let's head back in this cave. Alright. Now this puzzle can be a little tricky if you don't know what you're doing. You gotta be careful. We'll push this one over, this one over, this one, and then finally this one goes up. That's how you get out. Right. Slash these guys. Oh, get away. Alright, that's right. Alright, that's right, give me the money. The money, the money, the money. Alright, moving on. Read this sign. Beware of floors with cracks. A heavy person should not stand on them. Okay, like I already mentioned. Alright, even with the shield. That's what we you. Ah, boy. Alright. All right. Now, once you see this little area. Oh, look! A guardian acorn and a piece of power all at the same time. That's pretty lucky. Yeah, that glowing triangle that I just got makes your sword glow, obviously, and gives you a little power boost for a while. And I got, okay, well, I guess I don't get to show you the power of the piece of power because I accidentally dropped the dragon acorn, but anyway, you, you see the, you get the gist of it. Alright. Alright. There's another piece of heart, like the one that we found in that little well. Okay. And do not touch this. You can attack the little Gyarados looking like thing in the water. But, that little thing that looks, I don't even know what it looks like, but whatever, whatever you do, don't touch it. You're just going to hurt yourself. Alright. Hmm, this is strange. A dark room with a witch in it. Alright, let's talk to her. Double, double, toy in trouble. A toadstool mix makes powder for tricks. Hmm, toadstool mix? That's interesting. Well, I just happen to have one right here. How convenient. Alright, let's give it to her. Ah, it has the sleepy toadstool, it does. 
We'll mix it up something legit and real. Alright. Now she goes into like a uh, seizure with stirring. It's already it is. Take care, is there's not much there. Why not try a bit in my hut? You've got some magic powder. Try sprinkling it on a variety of things. A whole lot of Good job. Use it on your enemies and see what happens. If you run out, go to the forest, pick some mushrooms, and I will make you more. Alright, so like she said, obviously. Okay, that did nothing. Like she said, obviously you can keep going back to her after you find that mushroom in that same spot. It'll always be there. You can keep going back to her and she'll give you as much as you need. But, you know, we're not going to need that much right now, so it's cool. But for now, we're going to switch back to the sword and we'll come back to the powder in a minute. Come back! There's another guardian acorn. I find these all over the place today. I'm not too sure how many other places feature those items, but I don't believe it's very, uh, very common elsewhere. That's right. That's right. That's right. Take that, jerk. Alright. the cave. And head left. And go up here. Ah. It's that silly raccoon who said, uh, powder and dust makes him, makes him sneeze, he's allergic, so let's see what happens if you sprinkle some, some magic powder on him. Uh-oh, what's happening? Oh, he's going crazy. Must be on crack. That's weird. The last thing I can remember is biting into a big juicy toadstool. Then I had the darndest dream, I was a raccoon. Yeah, sounds strange, but it sure was fun. Alright, so that goofy guy accidentally turned into a raccoon when he ate the mushroom. Slightly reminiscent of uh, the craziness that happened when you ate the mushroom in Mother 3, but that's another story. Alright, let's open this chest up. Alright, you've got the tail key. Now you can open the tail cave gate. And of course, we're going to have a meeting with our friend Dale. Hoot, take the key and go to the tail cave. Retrieve the instrument that is hidden there. Go now. The wind fish is waiting. Hoot. Alright. So, now we got what we came here for. We need out of here. Alright. Don't need to spend any more time in this silly forest. Crap. <laughs> ah! What am I doing? Goodness. So now that we've acquired the tail key that will open the tail cave, we will head there next. We're going to stop here for now. Next episode, we'll be heading to the tail cave, which is the first dungeon in this game. Uh, I'm NHSDL06. Once again, thank you for watching, and I hope you stay tuned for more fun adventures with our hero, Pat. Thank you. Goodbye now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye.